The National Social Security Fund has a new policy on disbursement of money to those retiring. Qualifying members will now receive a portion of their savings at retirement while retaining some of their savings with the fund instead of a lump sum as has been the case. Eligible members will benefit from the arrangement in the following ways. Earning annual interest on their retained balance as will be declared each year. Having a cushion against losses that may arise due to rushed investment decisions. And maintaining a cash flow pattern that they may have been familiar with while still in employment. The arrangement, known as a drawdown payment plan, is a result of a survey conducted among 45 to 60 year old members who revealed that 62% prefer payment of their benefits in installments. Members will have a chance to determine the amounts they want to withdraw while the balance will be paid twice a year. This will initially be open to members that qualify for what we call the age benefit, which is paid to members that attain the age of 55 years, and withdraw benefit, which is paid to members who attain the age of 50 years but have been out of employment for a period of one year, and also paid to contributing members who join employment categories that are exempted. In other words, they basically do, they move from NSSF, they move from the private sector to maybe the public sector in that case. Meanwhile, for NSSF, retaining more savings means a bigger pool of funds from which to make future investments, a move it believes should have an impact on members' savings. Eronika Mkama, NTV Business.